everyone, it's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a first impression slash like review video for you guys on the Earth Therapeutics Beauty Blending Sponge. I got this from Kohl's and you're probably all thinking, Kohl's, that's not like a makeup store. But they do have a tiny like little beauty section and I was there um, back to school clothes shopping and I remembered that I needed a new makeup blending sponge and I saw that they had like a little section of these on sale um, for $4.20 and I was like hey that looks neat and I've heard good things about Earth Therapeutics and this actually looks a lot like the shape and like size of the actual beauty blender so I think that it'll work just fine and it's a lot cheaper than the normal one so I was like why not give this one a try so the old like makeup blending sponge that I have is the up and up brand one and this was again like around five dollars so when it comes to like makeup blending sponges I don't need the actual beauty blender although I'd really like one they're just expensive for a little sponge that blends in your makeup so I can get away with like close to five dollar ones and as you can see this one is kind of a weird shape and I wanted to try one that was similar to the shape of the actual beauty blender because it might work better or something but this one is also really dirty and it's kind of been like picked at and stuff and I've had this one for a while and I just really wanted like a change so that's why I got this so now I'm going to take it out of the package it came right up um wow this is really soft I really like that um the old one or the one from Target um it's really like firm and this one's so soft and just squishy Ooh, it's really soft um this one's kind of rough so I definitely say that this one is softer um yeah I really like this and it's super cute and it looks just like the regular beauty blender so so far I would definitely recommend this even though I haven't even used it I'm recommending this because this is just like the beauty blender although it's way less expensive which it's a bonus so yeah I like this so it says here on the back of the package that you're supposed to wet it in lukewarm water until it's completely saturated and then squeeze the excess water out so I'm gonna go get it wet before I apply the concealer with it as a little like demonstration so I'll be right back so as you may or may not be able to see I don't really think you can tell I <laughs> got this um wet or like damp and now I'm going to try it with some concealer because that's what I use my beauty blender for is concealer which is, you're probably all thinking that I should use it for foundation but I don't so now I'm just gonna blend it in um oh it got dirty fast okay but um um, so far, I think this is way easier to apply than this. This is just really rough. Although I do like this, I would definitely use this. Um, I'm just going to try this. So the lighting here in here is not the greatest, as you can probably tell. But... Overall, I really like this. I think it's really soft and squishy, and it helped apply the makeup really nicely, and I would definitely recommend this. So another bonus to this is on the back of the packaging, it says that it is non-latex and it is hypoallergenic, which is a plus. Um, and if I can remember correctly, this is actually called the Latex Super Blender. Um, I'll try and insert a picture here if I can. So as you just saw from the picture I just showed, um, this is the latex blender, which is what I was thinking, and that is probably a big factor as to why this one is more rough and like firm, is because it's made out of latex. So I would definitely recommend this over this. I'm um, sorry, this is like turning into a like comparing products video, which isn't what this is supposed to be, so I'll forget this one. But um, if you do want this one, I don't know why, this is the Up and Up brand Latex Super Blender, but goodbye for now. 
So, um, if you're ever searching for a new makeup sponge, I would definitely recommend the Earth Therapeutics brand. And it's such a good dupe for the actual Beauty Blender. I just checked online and the original Beauty Blender at Sephora is $19.95, so it is $20, and this was only $4.50 or $4.20, yeah, $4.20. Like I said, it was on sale, so it's originally $6, or at least at the Kohl's that I was at, it was $6 originally, but that's still way cheaper than the actual Beauty Blender, and I think, like, what I'm imagining is that this is exactly what the real Beauty Blender beauty blenders like because it's like the same size the same shape and it's probably made out of the same stuff so I would definitely recommend this I would give it five out of five stars and I would say that if you're ever searching for a new makeup sponge please go check out the earth therapeutics brand beauty blending sponge I will have a link to it down below so you guys can go check it out and get one for yourself um but yeah I love this so much I'm so happy I found it, and yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up, um, and also give it a thumbs up if you would like to see me do more, like first impression and like review videos. Comment down below some video ideas you have for me to do next time. I know I always say this, but it's true. I'm always in need of some video suggestions. Um, if there's any like products that you want me to try out before you buy them to like let you know if they're worth buying um let me know too because i might already have that product too you never know i can always do review videos they're pretty fun to do um i like getting new products and trying them out so yeah so like I said earlier, all products links will be down below. I will have the link to the Earth Therapeutics Blending Sponge. I will have a link to the Up and Up Super Blender, just in case you're interested in that one. And then I will also have a link to the concealer I used in this video, just in case you're interested in that as well. Um, this is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer for Dark Circles. And yeah, so please be sure to subscribe to see more videos often. I will try and post as much as I can. Um, it just depends on how busy I am or if I have any pre-filmed videos or if I run out of topics to film. So that's why you need to comment down below. Please, 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 if you want to see more videos, just comment some ideas and I will try to get around to those. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching once again and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye.